All righty, welcome back. I'm going to go through the uh, first part of your portfolio, which is the, um, the brainstorming refinement. So step one, brainstorm as many physical things that are reflective as you can and write them in the box below. So you've got five minutes to do that one. So these are physical things. So think about um, things that have reflective surfaces, um, things that may record you and play back. That's also a reflection. Um, so we're talking things like glass. Uh, you can talk about water. You can do it like eyes are a good one. Uh, glasses like sunnies. Um, there's different like car parts are shiny like chrome things. Um, all sorts. So think of as many things as you can and pop them in that one there. You may even want to cheat and go on Google and start looking up some reflective things. Then the second part, brainstorm as many non-physical things that are reflective as you can. So non-physical reflection could be something like self-reflection. So thinking about um, what you've done in the past and that sort of thing. So some people use like a diary for self-reflection. Some people talk to each other. Some people um, do voice memos. Um, I've heard people talking about therapy might be a, um, a form of self-reflection. So anything you can think of that isn't an actual physical thing or it's like how or it might be a... Um, uh, like a, an action may be reflective. So writing in a diary is an action um, that could be uh, classes reflective too. So in that one there, there's many non-physical things that are reflective. So like non, not items, I guess. After you've done that, I would go over them and have a look at which one uh, you like the best. Maybe write a pros and cons list. Uh, you can go back and change this. Um, and then we're going to go down to here. So choose what issue or idea and brainstorm as many issues or ways you could think of uh, photograph it. So what you're picking out of here, your favorite one there, that goes up here, your topic idea and why you chose it. I can see I've got a um, spelling mistake there. Doesn't matter. So you may have picked um, like uh, mirrors. Oops your topic and then you get in this one here you're going to write in as many ideas of, uh, of photos and setups you could do using mirrors or so how you're going to take photos of it. okay so you may even want to go through and go okay mirror photography and get some ideas that way alrighty so you're going to write that in there with your ideas and um, yeah start uh, thinking about what photos you can take the next part of the video i'll go in and do the planning um okay